hi everyone now in this video we will see one more example for constructing isometric view of a solid from the orthographic projections as on the screen you can see that the front view and top view of a solid ok. So, first we will construct this front view you can see it consists of two different solids one is the angle plate and exactly in the center a rectangular block. So, these two combines together into a single solid the same thing you can see this completely represents angle plate on the center one rectangular block. So, first we will construct this angle plate 65, 40, 15, 20, 15 is the dimension ok. AutoCAD we entered into the 3D modeling now units yes limits 0 comma 0 yes select the front view polyline ortho 60 65 40 not 60 control z 65 40 15 So, 40 minus uh, here 15 means 25, 25, 50, 50, yes. Now, see, we will give the thickness of the solid, the thickness is 40 mm. So, set it to south west isometric extrude ok enter 40 mm. We can give south east also, but this is not clearly visible. So, we will choose south west isometric. Yes, south west isometric will give you the clear details ok. So, the first part get completed. Now, second part this rectangular block you can see width is 30 length is 20 and the thickness of this solid is 10 mm. So, either you can draw this portion and then we can extrude like this otherwise we can draw this portion and then we can extrude this. So, yeah, I will show it to you here. So, we have to take center line first midpoint yeah this is the center line. Now, line the offset distance the thickness is see the rectangle uh, block thickness is 10 mm. So, what I am going to do is that 5 mm yes. So, this is the 5 mm line now poly line from here I am going to construct a rectangle 30 20 30 20 I give 5 mm from the center line. So, from this location I constructed this this one now already 5 mm is there. So, some more 5 mm so completely 10 mm we have to extrude you can see E x t otherwise you can take this here extrude select this one enter 
10 mm. See, perfectly it fits to this half portion on that side, half portion this side. So, to check front view, okay, perfect. Left view, perfect. Right view, okay. Top view, perfect. So, everything is perfect. So, southwest isometry. But as I said, see now here this is an individual solid and this is an individual solid. So, combine in the previous tutorial we saw how to remove how to remove a solid from one solid from to another there we use the command subtract. Now, in this present assignment or the example we have to combine. So, to combine two solids into a single one use the command union union select these two enter see now completely both join together x ray top view perfect southwest isometry for the sake of clarity yes everything is finished again we will keep in 2d wireframe go to the layout as we discussed in the previous tutorial click on the paper when you click on the paper it moves to a paper space take the pan command move it aside remove the grid section base from model space here I am placing it here because I want southwest isometric here and then here here and yes I do not want this orthographic already it is there in the question remove select 2 is to Yes. Yes. To give the thickness, a layer properties for hidden, we'll use blue color. Okay for visible using red color ok line weight LW display line weight ok. So, after this one again click on the layer properties it will disappear dimension aligned dim edit. So, before dim editing we will give the original dimensions 15 ok 20 30 10 15 40, height is 40, yes dim style to increase the modify text I am giving 5 ok close yeah. 
now we will make the dimensions parallel to this dim edit oblique So, to remove this, just click on paper. Yes, the exclamatory marks vanishes. You can write the text in the paper space only. Sorry, model space. Six. click on the paper now it is ready save it and export